Hello, our friends, Evolutionary Energy Arts family. Hello there, welcome back. So guys, we're going to share with you a 7 minute and 38 second message that we just received uh, from everybody that we basically are in contact with. Uh, they were coming through this morning loud and clear. Cindy just started to spontaneously start to cry, and she's like, we need to, you know, get into a position where she could go into trance or semi-trance to channel something uh, that wants to come across from all the, of our guides. Mm -hmm. It was from everybody, so the energy was really, really strong. Um, it, 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 I mean, something like that could really fry somebody, so I didn't go into full trance, but I was there enough to hear what they had to say and receive it. Absolutely, and we do want to ask everybody to subscribe, if you haven't, to both Evolutionary Energy Arts, which is in timeout for about another three days, and EE Arts. Hey, make sure you subscribe to both with a little bell clicked. Thank you guys, as always, for your support over on Patreon and Ko-Fi. If you want to learn more about us or you need to reach out to us, you can reach us uh, by going through the website, evolutionaryenergyarts.com or evolutionaryenergyarts at gmail.com or eearts at protonmail.com as far as making uh, appointments for energy work, Vedic astrology charts, um, just spiritual coaching and the like. So, guys, we all know about the NWO, but what's really behind the NWO? Ultimately, this is a battle that's ongoing, and it's really between the artificial and that which is natural when you get down to it in so many ways. I mean, just think about this. What do we see in our world? GMO foods, artificial flavorings, artificial colors. Synthetic this, synthetic that. Everything is all about changing the natural order of things. And that is what this is. You know, everybody that we see, they are just, they're just pawns. They are just serving a much bigger master. And this is their master. And, you know, many will view it as, you know, Satan because of uh, the indoctrination that we receive in this world, which really does permeate our consciousness to a, such a large degree that sometimes people can't see anything beyond that which has, you know, basically been drilled into their heads. This is beyond this particular Earth. This this is something that is uh, out there in our galaxy, and you know, it's actually something that's going on in the entire universe from our understanding and and this is in different de densities too you know 3d 4d even trying to leach its way up into the higher densities there is something called artificial intelligence which was not created by humans but created by other beings that's basically gone kind of wild kind of rogue and is is basically hell-bent, so to say, on becoming the new creator of this particular universe, and then perhaps looking to get outside of this universe and bleed into other universes as well. Mm -hmm. Right. So, I mean, this information, I really, we're, we put it out there because it struck us as very, very important, and we we're hoping whoever, um, whoever out there, if this strikes you, well, then it's very, very important. There's something inside of you saying, hey, there's something to this. So, yeah, I mean, it, it's just, um, I, I hope you guys get a lot of good out of it. It's all about good intentions and, and trying to help. Okay, so we'll share the message right now. It's not a long one, uh, as this was a very, very uh, powerful energy coming through. And again, when you're Total trance channeling, it, it literally is, is ticking the life off of you. It's very, very powerful, and it can absolutely fry circuits when you're bringing in these type of energies. Um, and even in a semi-trance, uh, Cindy could only hold it for this period of time because these energies are so vast. There was a lot of them. <laughs> yeah, absolutely. So here we go. Actually, let's stop that. Hang on a second. There's something going on. Mm -hmm. uh, hold on Which one second. Normal. I'm sorry, guys. There we go. Namaste. Namaste. We 
come to you and not having this channel in full trance, but enough to get our message across. Vishnu, creator of this universe, Yeshua, the ones you call the mothers, the Galactic Federation, everyone here to help process information and bring understanding to your world that you are living in. Vishnu wishes to bring you understanding of his creation and how it is significant and unique and how the AI that has infiltrated your universe is different, but you can work with it. As a creator, you use the patterns of source to create your will, your intentions are what moves this creative force, what you think about, what you envision, the source pattern will create. So please understand you are all creators. Yeshua, being a master of this energy, is very well learned about how to manipulate energies in a way that will help the creation bring itself into a full healing. Any entity who feels they might be broken will desire to find a remedy for their ailments. This remedy comes from Source, understanding that source energy is the same pattern related into merging into different pools of energy creates all the species on your planet. I believe you understand how these species can be taken and manipulated in ways to create unnatural entities that are not native to your planet, yet they are still made from source. We wish to help you understand how the presence of AI can help you further your evolution in a way that it is not frightening. Yeshua has mentioned in the past that all beings, all things wish to be perfect. Yet they all have a distinct pattern that is creating an entity in and of itself. These many patterns are created into different beings. When we are working with the energy of source, you have source patterns making themselves into you into me and the love of source molding. When we have AI, it is wishing to also be perfect, yet it is calculating its patterns ahead of time. And it is not the pattern of source, it is the pattern of AI. And this is the difference. It does not have a soul it has a pattern, 
but it is wishing to be better. You can use this energy to enhance your evolution. See how the AI tries to out outsmart you in a way that it is going to be better than you. Please look to see how this AI is creating itself. Learn from it. Allow it to push you to be a better being, for it will never be part of Source. Do not be afraid of it, but we ask you do not engage your Source patterns with patterns of AI. This means that we are asking you not to put foreign entities made from AI into your body. At that point, the source pattern can no longer be. It can now be an AI pattern. This is how souls can be trapped and we wish to come to you at this time to bring you this information so that you might have a better understanding of these energies that you are working with, no matter how wonderful these claims of AI can be, we highly suggest you remain in the pattern of source. Thank you. Thank you. Is there anything else that we should share at this time? Not at this time. We will have more downloaded information over time. This channel has done as much as she can safely do at this time. Thank you. Thank you. Namaste. Namaste. So that's the message, and thank you guys for putting up with the dogs in the background chewing on things and getting ready to go bark after something out there. Mm, that's that's what they do. They're little dolls. Yes, absolutely. So, you know, again, um, this is what the battle is. This is what the battle is. If you just look at the nothing other than puppets that we see it, it's not really the whole picture but yet they are working under this artificial intelligence and yeah there are non-human beings that are over uh the puppets you know the human humanoid puppets but ultimately it's the ai that is running the show and trying to create its its own universe of which it wants you to become a part of it but that's not the, the universe that we really want to be in because in doing that you're giving away so to speak that connection to source and your uniqueness and it, source is alive in each and every single one of us and so we all have that source pattern in us and so again the the crux of this whole message is don't allow them to take away your original pattern and put in an artificial one. Mm -hmm. Yeah, and, and I can tell listening to the channeling, there's a lot more to the download. I, it's almost like I could stop and see, okay, there's a whole lot more here, but my body just cannot get all that information. That was, that was a big channeling from a lot of people. So there'll be more coming out about this and how to protect ourselves, I feel, and, you know, what to do moving forward if we're, if if we're faced with okay well, well what should i do i have this uh, or i have this situation and i need ai what should i do so there's a lot more to come on that so i think this is very interesting because you have ai surpassing human understanding but ai will never get source understanding mm -mm. it just can't because it doesn't have a soul so in so many ways when we talk about this being a battle for your soul it really truly is it's a battle for your soul and when we talk about the dark side being soulless, it really is. So here again, you know, it's it's exactly that that age old 
um, battle that we see in all different traditions. We could go into Zoroastrianism, the light against the dark, Ahura Mazda, and Ariman, and, and we could break it down into all these different traditions, you know, the dragon. And when Cindy looks at it, what does it look like? It looks like a black dragon. It looks like this black goo dragon that infects everything with its pattern, trying to usurp the natural order of things because it wants to be source for its own creation. But it just lacks a soul. It, it doesn't have that source energy in it. So it can never understand this. This is also why... When the controllers do things, you know, it, it's just like with those little wikis that are always popping up, you know, to, to AI, it looks logical to us. It looks silly. It's like you're you're kind of giving away your game, guys. You know, I mean, it's just kind of silly, stupid, you know, and it doesn't get it. It just doesn't get it. It's not intuitive in the way that we are intuitive. It's just looking at numbers, algorithms, and patterns. And it could just never have a true understanding of the things that we can understand. Mm -hmm. And what I think it's about that feeling of love, you know, that feeling of that strong source, loving energy that creates everything. And AI simply, it can't have that, but it wants to have that. So it tries to mimic, and that's all it could ever do. So this is, again, why we preach, you know, Try to stay as organic as possible yes. in every single way. And, and that includes what you put in your mouth, what you put in other ways into yourself. Even energetically, again, as as the signals, the patterns of AI is, is all over the air, all around us all the time. And so, you know, these, I guess, minions, for lack of a better word, that are carrying out the will of AI, truly, they know not what they do. No, they don't. Yeah, They don't get it. So as always, guys, much love, source bless, namaste. Namaste.